Trinity Gardens has become a burden on city government. So says Commissioner Lambert Mims. Blacks and some whites who have opposed the city's appeal of Judge Virgil Pittman's order, changing Mobile's form of government, have said the residents of Trinity Gardens have been shortchanged. Mims, defending the commissioner form of government, said this is not true. This area was taken into the city back in 1961, a decision many think now to be a bad one. For years, many of the 5,000 residents have lived in squalor. Mim says since 1965, a total of $77,000 in property taxes have been paid by the residents, and they have paid some $329,000 in sales taxes. In return, Mim states they have received $5 million in city services and another $4 million is programmed. This in spite of the fact that 42% of the residents live below the poverty level. Since 1965, Mim states that the city has spent $1,179.25 per person living in the area, and they have received back in taxes $15.47. Presently, the 1.32 mile area has 13 miles of streets, with nine still unpaved. Poll records show the people have almost no interest in exercising their voting rights. In spite of the improvements, there are some that feel that if you are poor, you should look poor. Well, for many of the residents of Trinity Gardens, that criteria is being met. Dick Darby, Channel 10 Newsbeat.